Stuck her. He's hurt. He's hurt right here. They're picking her up. We fucking reload the goddamn weapon. I don't know where they were at. Should be a flashbang on my body if someone hadn't picked it up. Jesse, what in the goddamn are you doing, man? He's going to plan on A like a fucking Momo. I hear. Yeah, she's close to me. Mm hmm. What is going on everyone? Griffin here coming at you with some Saint gameplay and today we're going to talk about possible harsher AFK or deserter penalties coming in 2022 of Rogue Company. So let's head over and check it out. So this is the Switchblade update and I know this came out July the 6th of 2021 and the reason that I'm bringing this up is because when you scroll right down here AFK slash lever backfill functionality. We will be starting phase one of our efforts to address the AFK and lever problem with the Switchblade update. During phase one, when a player deserts a match due to being AFK or quitting early, they will be replaced by a bot. The bot's difficulty will scale based on the skill of the players inside the match to ensure a quality experience. If the deserter reconnects to the match, they will replace the bot. Phase two is a larger effort, but we're excited to share that we're working on a player backfill system. We will have more details on that shortly. So this article for the Switchblade update was in July the 6th. It was not very long after that at all that they actually took the bots out of the game. And the reason that they took the bots out of the game was because there was no benefits whatsoever to having a bot on your team or just being one man down because the bots were mindless, brain dead, AI running into walls and not contributing whatsoever to your team. Um, you know, they were very ambitious saying that the bot's difficulty is going to scale based on the skill of the player inside uh, the match to ensure a quality experience, but it does not seem to have worked that way, and I don't think it's ever going to work that way, in my opinion. Um, and they're saying that Phase 2, they were going to introduce the player backfill system, and they haven't released any more details on that. And I know that right now in the game, there is a huge problem with people going AFK or being a deserter. It's happened almost, I would say, a good 8 out of 10 matches. If it's me and a couple of people queuing and we've got one random on our team, it's almost inevitable that that random, or at least one of the two randoms, if there's two of us, or possibly more that end up dropping while I'm playing the game. And it feels something that is happening rampantly throughout the community because whenever you go over to Reddit or if you go on Twitter or places like that, a lot of people are commenting on the fact that they're not being able to play full matches because of the amount of people that are go just going AFK or deserting the match. And at this point, a backfill system would be better than nothing, in my opinion. Uh, I know that that is a little bit... Like right now, we've seen issues with one of my buddies that's been playing with a Dirt Lord, and he's been having PC problems. He'll crash out, and then he'll join back into the game, which it's all good and great. It's like one or two rounds before he gets back in there, but before you know it, you get a full team back in there. No big deal whatsoever. But if they're going to introduce this backfill system, then that's not going to be something that's going to be doable. That means that that person is going to be a flat-out deserter, and they're going to get penalized for it. Even though the game's not crashing and he's not leaving it, it's because he's having system issues with his own personal system. Um, I do think that in the future there needs to be harsher AFK or deserter penalties before they actually move into the backfill system. I feel like the people that are just connecting to the game and going AFK or that are leaving the game, they have an opportunity to come back. And if they choose not to, then give them the deserter penalty. Only have it count down while they're in game. 
and they it needs to be way harsher than it currently is. I think that, you know, by the second or third time that this happens and they're unable to reconnect, it needs to be like a 24 hour ban at that point. It needs to be a temporary ban. It needs to be a suspension, whatever you want to call it, because by doing nothing, you're promoting the fact that you can do that and get away with it. I mean, in all reality. And three minutes, four minutes, five minutes deserter penalty means absolutely nothing in the grand scheme of things because that's a bathroom break. You know what I mean? That's letting the dog out. That's all that is. And then come back and you're able to play again. And if the match isn't going your way, then you just dip on out and then you take another couple of minutes until you get fed up with the game enough where you don't want to play it anymore. So I think that harsher penalties do need to come down the pipeline. And I do think that they need to look at the AFK slash lever functionality right now. I, th I don't think that bots was the right decision to make by any stretch of the imagination. I don't know if, if the backfill system is the right answer to that, but I think that they need to do something. And I think that 2022, if we start that off with a bang, and hopefully talk about this whenever they do the high res showcase, maybe we'll get a little bit more insight into it. Um, I do know that it's frustrating for the player base, and I feel for each and every one of the people out there that are having to deal with this. I know in 6v6 it's not as prominent. I know in 6v6 it's not as noticeable. But whenever you're playing Demolition 4v4 and things like that, it is way, way, way more noticeable, especially in ranked and, and those type of game modes. And I do feel a lot of people's pain points on it because it's like, why should I play this game? Why should I continue to play this game when I'm at a constant disadvantage? And I get it. Why? You know? But this is where we are. This is where I hope that we're going to be going is some type of, you know, harsher system in place for AFK and deserters. So be sure to let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Do you think that there needs to be harsher penalties for AFK and deserters? Or do you think that the system is fine as is? Are you experiencing a ton of matches right now where you do have AFK and levers in your matches? Be sure to let me know. Also, check the description for links to Facebook, Discord, and Twitter. Those are the places to contact me. And if you haven't already, please be sure to like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching, guys. In the middle. They're over here. Yeah, I'm hard scope, mother. Trenches in here in this room in front of me. Uh, the multiples. other two, like in the middle. They're coming over in the back here, side over hard. here. On me. There's one behind the triangle, I think. Hey. Why are they splitting? Oh. He's on the left up here. Got two in front of him. No, they're all in front of him now. We're rotating that way. Fucking one shot. I think they might I be going I could have swore I heard somebody closer. I thought, yeah, it sounded like they were right on us, didn't it? And one in the middle there. Two in the middle. Got EMP. Bam. I hear them. They're in this room. There's no Maybe fucking way. There's no goddamn way I hit that bitch with a goddamn C4 directly and she survived. They're all in that room back there.
Is this trench gonna goddamn turtle like that other trench? One, two, one. He ain't trench anymore. Oh, Look at the sniper. Right. Yeah, but they don't have sniper rifles, so. Maybe. They're right behind me. Switchblade. She's hurt. We traded. Torch is coming backside. Oh god damn. I'm one. Taking him now. They're both here on me, both. Alright. Music to my Oh, no one God. fucking shot. They're both over here. One, two, one again. Actually, it's like one, one, two. What? No! Why's around the corner there? I went to take that goddamn zip line and it just threw me off the map. So that's always fun. There's two on left over here. I have the bomb. Utility out. They've got us trapped. Pulling. God damn it. No hit markers. Zero. Run it again. There. I could take it the right way this time. There's two over there. There's somebody on left. Scorch is on left on the thing. Well, how's she on the other side of that? I have no idea. What the fuck? Which blade was on goddamn B? I almost had goddamn sniper. That doesn't seem right. That flash lasted forever. Yeah, I know. Yeah. I wish he would wait until we got closer to snap. Oh, he's behind the cop car. Yeah, it's switchblade. Switchblade. He's hurt. He's hurt right here. They're picking her up. Let me fucking reload the goddamn weapon. I don't know where they were at. Should be a flashbang on my body if someone hadn't picked it up.
Jesse, what in the goddamn are you doing, man? He's going to plan on A like a fucking Momo. Fucking no. I hear. Yeah, she's close to me. I think this might be a chick. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Scorch is somewhere over here. He's on okay. left. He's pushing through right Got now. Got switchblade in front of me. He's dead. I'm rotating to you, I'm Corey. Fucked. Oh, I'm rotating. Uh, she's half right here. I was coming, man. Could be wrong, but you know. Could be a trans. Too early. Yeah. Legit though. Shot cop car. I went in my general vicinity here. We well, got runway coming somewhere. Your dancing just couldn't keep up. A plant. Watch him back. Or just trying to creep around behind us back here. They're coming. They're coming. They're pushing me right now. God damn it. Couldn't get the fucking thing off. God damn it. Flash somebody. Flashing again. Flashed him again. Oh shit. Oh, I'm getting shot from across the way. for significant damage. He's right here. Fuck, fuck. He's swinging his sword on me. They don't have time. Oh, <laughs> oh, fuck yeah, dude. Hell yeah. They all landed and spawned and stayed there until we planted the bomb. And then creeped around the back side. All th like, what the fuck? I'm sorry, Adam. I was in the middle of hacking that motherfucker and I couldn't do anything. Oh, he didn't get me. I got away from him. Okay. I thought he might have downed you. No. I saw him coming with that sword out and I just rolled. I was like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> like, get him away from the bomb. It's about to blow up. Now that felt like a fucking... Yeah, I would say there's experience. a difference. Yeah, for sure, right? God damn, dude. Boost it.